I need to jump to Mexico because after that country's most notorious drug lord, El Chapo, Shorty, escaped a high security prison via a makeshift tunnel this weekend. Many questions are being raised about why he wasn't extradited to the United States. Bloomberg's Victor Michel is uh, in Mexico City. He has covered the drug war and the nation's problematic uh, prison system. Victor, what explanation does uh, the president, Enrique Peña Nieto, have to offer for the fact that El Chapo escaped and furthermore that his decision not to have him extradited to the United States now proves, has proven to be so mistaken. Good morning. Yeah, this is a hugely embarrassing development for President Peña Nieto. He came into office three years ago with a promise, with the pretense that his government would implement better security strategies, a more intelligent uh, way to fight the drug cartels, and now we have this situation. A year ago, the then Attorney General Jesus Murillo Karam said that he would gladly extradite El Chapo Guzman to the United States only after he served a 400-year prison sentence here in Mexico. Obviously, that wasn't going to happen. One of the main theories that is going around here in Mexico is that the Mexican government didn't want to extradite El Chapo to the United States because he would give a lot of embarrassing information to the American officials about Mexican officials, Mexican government figures that have been bought off in the past years. So. 18 people and perhaps more have been taken into questioning prison employees. Do you have any word on what they've been saying or any of them talking? Yeah, at this point, they're being questioned by U.S. trained interrogators. They, they are part of the Attorney General's office. They're going to be interrogated for the next couple of days. No information has been given about what they are saying, but we have confirmation that at this point, several high-ranking officials, high-ranking prison, of prison officials have been fired and are being questioned also because there is a presumption that there was cooperation from inside the prison. Well, and there the, almost certainly uh, had to be cooperation. There's no way that El Chapo uh, could have... Tunneled could have, out himself. Tunneled out himself and furthermore had a... Uh, uh, a motorcycle, a motorcycle waiting. track waiting uh, upon his arrival. Victor, we thank you very much for the update on the escape of El Chapo and what the Mexican government is doing about it. Victor Michel in Mexico City.